io abitavo nella curva che va verso Gibellina e c'era lo bastione e poi sotto lo bastione c'era il giardino di mia nonna, mia padre, mia madre, c'erano le arance, le limone, le granate, i fichi di indi, ce n'era assai, figurini, non ci mancava niente, c'era tutto, c'era tutto. Because my father died when I was very young and we had the farm to take care of, nonna had to make sure she had enough helper to do the farming. She would help her cousin family and then her cousin family would come to help her and both help each other do the farming. We had uh, property and uh, three, four different places. Some maybe five, six acres, some was half an acre, some there were five acres. And you have to look after. The main thing, it was religious. You go to church every Sunday. You Going to church was like when you go out here, you go out on Friday night. Their church was important. You go there, you meet your friend, you pray, then you go home. La chiesa c'era tutte le immagini come Roma, Roma tutte le immagini sculturate, tutte quelle era una chiesa meravigliosa. Everybody go to church. It's tight uh, community, you know, because you know everybody. In Sicily, it's warm. I mean, summertime, oh man, you couldn't even breathe. But in wintertime, it gets uh, a little bit cold, like I say, when it rains. Other than that, it's pretty nice temperature. I only saw snow twice in my life over there. 1955 and in 1968, just uh, when the earthquake happened. The, the day of the earthquake was on a Sunday. So Sunday you go to mass in the morning. Then we came home, we had lunch. And we had uh, two bottles uh, on the table. One was Frizzina and one was regular water. Just ready to sit and I see the the two bar like da, 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 you know, so they know what it was. Nella strada vicino alla chiesa della de, de Purgatoio, vedeva una ragazza che lavava le scaluna dei fiori, che c'erano uno, due, tre scaluna, e lavava le fiori così. Mentre che salvava la fiore, io l'ho salutato. Ai Anna, ci disse Anna, buongiorno Anna, era più piccola di me. L'ho salutata, dice, oh, stai lavando lo, le scaluna, e si ha detto. Tutto di una volta, a chi ha detto essa con me, ha caduto un pezzo della chiesa. We heard a loud bang and everybody ran outside. One of the, the support of a church just kicked right out and we thought that was it. That was around 20 after 12, January 13. Everybody went doing their own things, and around five o'clock, then we had another tremor. One of our neighbors, he worked for City Hall. I don't know his title, but he was an engineer or something. He came to all the neighbors, you know, went out of the door and said to everybody, please remain calm, this is an earthquake. Allora c'è sempre mio figlio Tony, scende di blocco sopra, che monina, chiappate un paro di pantaloni a una cosa, di copuro la tuta, che era angusciata, che solo portava per lavoro. Che te la metti perché era di domenica, erano vestite buone, no? Mia figlia Rosina ha preso una borsetta e le scarpe nuove che ci aveva comprato, che si doveva mettere per Natale. I just went out the door with the clothes I had run, another pair of shoes, no blanket, nothing. We didn't know if we thought we were going to come home that night. You locked the door and we all went. We went to my grandfather, which had a property just close by the town. And we had a big bonfire. We had about 60, 80 people in there. 
e c'era la casa, noi potevamo riparare, facevamo fuoco con le legna, le cose. Siamo stati tutti là, e tutti si riunivano là, ma qualcuno della famiglia che era uscita per la piazza o nella nonna, che, che si sono tutti distaccati. And uh, we had uh, a little train around 8, 9 o'clock and then around uh, 12, 30 at night, that's when... Uh, Even though it was cold, the moon was shining and um, I could see the tower and the castle and the, and the cathedral of my town. They were swinging back and forth, back and forth. Like the whole tower, I could see it swinging. La terra si rapia puro. Lo sai quando fa come una, una piaga nel terreno e affacciava come una lingua di fuoco. Fuoco, ne si va fuoco della terra. And um, like the ground moves so much that if you were sitting in one spot, you would find yourself somewhere else. And uh, with the dust from the town, because my grandfather's villa was in the lower part of town, so the dust kind of settled over us. You didn't find, like I was sitting next to my mother, I didn't know where my mother was. If you're open, you can feel the wind. You can feel the sun, the cold, the heat. Hurricane, you don't feel nothing. Così non c'è stato niente, dopo cominciarono le lacrime, le giri, ci abbracciavano con l'altro. Tutte le persone, tu lo sai in Italia, qualche uomo alle volte bisticciava e bestemmiava, diceva le paloracce brutte. E c'era una che era cattolica, oggi quelle che hanno bestemmiato non credo che hanno il coraggio di bestemmiare, ci diceva quella signora, cioè perché dice veramente un peccato, c'è cioè stato un castigo di Dio e tutti pregavamo. So until the daylight came out, then it got a little bit calmer, but then the news reporter knew about the earthquake, so the arm came to rescue us. And when um, they took us in the trucks, the army, to, to take us to a safer place, to a school, to a different town, My mother kept me and her together, and my brother kept the three of us together. At one point, one, of, um, one person took my brother and said, no, you go to this truck and you guys go there. My mother said, no, 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 no. Wherever he goes, we go. We stay together in the same truck. Because one truck could go to one city and another go to another one. So you had to stay together. Nonna was smart with that. You cannot forget where you come from. A lot of people say they forget where they come from, they forget the language. I haven't lost any of that. I have a good memories where I come from and bad ones too. For me, it took me about three to four years to start to really say, now I want to be part of Canada. The first year, it's terrible. You don't like it. The houses are different. Um, you are not used to see so much grass, so much land around your house that you think you, you are, I don't know, you're not in town. Uh, where I come from is still in my heart because you can't forget your first 20 years of your youth, all the friends that you had, all the things that you've done. All your relatives are there, some uh, Deceased, some they're still alive. But this is my country. La yard c'ha le peperoni, c'ha la cicoria, le zucchine siciliane, le fagioline che sono alte, io arrampico e le raccoglio e ce n'ho ancora dentro. Mi passo il tempo, la mattina all'otto, che mi lavo, vado fuori con lo caffè, 
c'è lo tavolo, sotto la l'uva, mi prendo lo caffè, sento le uccelline che cantano, la vita è un po' tranquilla. Non, non sono una che mi metto al telefono tutti i giorni con l'amica, le cose. Mi piace la vita più normale, più siciliana. So I feel blessed, I always feel blessed. I lived through the earthquake. I was fortunate enough to go to school and come into Canada. I was fortunate enough to marry a very good person. I know what I have here and I'm happy with that. So why should you worry about what could have been, you know?